Right, hello, and welcome to another day, another video, another vlog. So, little subject for you. Um, after watching Mr. Fifty. I vlog. Well, the reason I vlog the way I vlog, apparently, I am classed as unconventional because I've never really got a subject as such. But today, I, I basically wanted to chat about with you guys why I do the vlogs the way I do them around here. So yeah, the reason I reason I do vlogs the way I do vlogs, I've covered. I think I might have covered this in a previous video, um, but I want to reiterate the reason. And I'll make sure my mic's in. I want to do this again because a lot of people think that the reason why I, I don't do vlogs the way the same as everybody else is, and I want to go down there. Oh fuck it, is because. Basically, I treat them, even gentlemen. Yeah, the reason the reason I do I do what I do is I class vlogs as like a diary. So, to me, this me talking to you at the moment is like a diary of what happened today on the way to work, to from work, wherever, wherever, whatever. So basically I treat my vlogs as a diary of what I'm doing, where I've been. I'm saying arms, ah, ah, after watching Mifty, don't say arms, do not say arms, or ahs. <laughs> I've just done two there, two, two rules broken. But yeah, that's why I vlog the way I vlog. Because to me, it's the way I want to do them for a start and and that's it. So they're like, like a little diary type thing. Right, I have to be quiet here for a minute. I do apologise for the wait, but I'm now in traffic. Traffic. That's better. <laughs> yeah, I was going to go up the hill, but no, not now. Yeah, so basically to me, a vlog is like a diary. Or blog or whatever, whatever you want to call it, blog, blog, uh, diary, one of those, one of those are, are probably the category that I'm in. I still class myself as a motor vlogger or a trainee motor vlogger because I'm still learning, I'm always learning. I also want to talk about while I'm actually here, subjects is the new GoPro range. But as a lot of you know, I've just bought that. So it kind of fucks me off a little bit, knowing that GoPro has another variant of that one. The uh, Session 5, or Hero Session 5, which I'm not sure, I'm not sure on the Session 5. Yes, the voice commands are absolutely brilliant. But as a motor vlogger, does the voice command actually work? Because you've got a crash helmet on your head. You can't say GoPro take photo because it wouldn't hear you. So I'm not, as a vlogging camera, as in if you've got it outside of the crash helmet, walking along, doing videos or whichever of the bike countryside, a particular topic, then yeah. Yeah, I can see that working. Same as the Hero 5 Black. I can definitely see that all working outside of the crash helmet environment. Inside the crash helmet environment, the voice controls will not work. And I'm going, you motherfuckers. The, um, yeah, Hero 5 Black looks nice. It's a lot smaller than, my, than that one. It's a lot smaller than that one. But I don't, the voice command, yes. 
it has an advantage but I can see issues with it. If your bike coughs and splats, is the camera going to go, oh, he said this. Time lapse mode, picture mode, etc. So is that, is that going to interfere? Also, while I'm here, GoPro's little drone. Well, they're not calling it a drone, they're calling it a vi capturing, video capturing device at its best, or something. I don't know. But that's that's what they're calling it, I've got to remember, centre of the road. Centre of the road. Sorry Baron, I keep turning into you, I keep trying to change my words into yours. I do apologise, I've done it for a while, that's because I watch your videos dude. GoPro's Karma looks absolutely fucking awesome, but it doesn't come with the camera. And because I've only got a Hero 3 Plus, it's sort of not going to work with my camera so I will have to either get a 4 black or silver or go out and get the new 5 system again the, the, on what I've seen I'm not only going what I've seen on YouTube is the 5 system is very much like I don't know if it's got interchangeable batteries I've not I've got a fucking C4 cactus up my ass I, I don't know the actual camera specifications as such, whether it's got an interchange battery or anything like that. But the one touch record like I've got on my session is really 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 cool. I do I do like that as you would have seen in the uh, little review video that I did for that one. That is an awesome idea having that one touch record. Oh waved right hand this time right fucking hand I should do that. Oh, hello. Don't say thank you. I've just let you out. The other thing that I think is going to be fucking really awesome, really, really cool, is GoPro's hand grip. I don't know, over the bumps. It's GoPro's new hand grip with the stabilisation, which goes with, uh, I think you have to buy the Karma kit, which, if so, it's a shame, because it is a really, really good idea. With the, you know, the stabilisation on the hand grip, so you can focus, just similar to the Osmo, well, I believe similar to the Osmo, probably not that well find but yeah if, if it works as well as what they're saying it works that is another really really good feature for, for not motor vloggers as such but normal vlog so anyway I'm going to go in a bit because uh, I'm nearly where I gotta go not far off actually I'll call it here Okay people, thank you very much as always for watching, liking and uh, viewing my videos. You guys are fucking awesome. You are. You're really, really awesome. Thank you very much for all your support. Remember to like, comment and share even if you think that you know, some of my videos deserve a little share. Go for it. Literally, share to your heart's content. But, yeah. Thank you, as always. I'll catch you in the next video. <laughs> Get the top going. Let's <laughs> go. That would help.